Yes, this is really happening. I officially declare no one's put this much work into this. So Brad, why don't you tell, tell the camera here what what brands of beer you decided to use for this? <laughs> well, Bud Light Lime, because that's what I normally drink. Does that so sound much, the best, Bud Light Lime? I don't know if it does. This, I like the summer, <laughs> the tinginess of the summer champagne. Okay, so got Bud Light Lime. What else? And year old Miller Lite. Year old Miller Lite. And then has a different chamber, just like an old guitar. Uh, but Line and Kugels is probably the. That's what fancy drummers play, I imagine. <laughs> That's so what they play over in Europe when they do beer bottle solos, is line yeah. of Googles. <laughs> How does cocaine go? <laughs> <laughs> All of a sudden, this is like the. Alcoholic version of the bells. <laughs> yeah. The carol of the theaters. <laughs> and, I, you know, I'm assuming we want an actual... more than just noise with it. Yeah, I mean, it's, it should be like a definite defined rhythm. Yeah. Like whatever, if some, like... Kind of like in the Hotel California when he goes, -ding 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 -ding, you know, it's like a signature rhythm in a so small space. Yep. You know, so like something similar to simple like that, but or whatever Sheila you would do if you were here. If any of the bands have done a beer bottle solo, how many of them have overdubbed? <laughs> yeah.